In the heart of Orion, more than a thousand light years away, a star has just been born. It flickers behind a veil of dust, fragile, glowing, alive. Astronomers call it HOPS 315, but what matters isn't its name, it's what's happening around it. With the James Webb Space Telescope and ALMA, we've seen something almost mythical. Tiny grains of dust clinging together, beginning the slow dance that will one day form planets. These specks are smaller than the eye can see, yet inside them lies everything. The calcium that may become bone, the iron that may flow as blood, the silicate that might one day become glass, sand, or a world. This is how it all begins, chaos learning to dream. The Orion Nebula isn't peaceful, it's violent, full of radiation, shock waves, and collision. And yet, amid that storm, something delicate unfolds. Dust collides, it sticks, it breaks and forms again, each impact a heartbeat in the making of a world. It's the same process that once built our home, when the sun was young and the atoms that now make you drifted through space, waiting to meet. And as this new star takes its first breath, another has been breathing for nearly 12 billion years. HD 110067, a quiet star, a hundred light years away, with six planets moving in perfect rhythm, a cosmic waltz that's lasted longer than almost any system in the universe. Two stars, two stories, one just beginning, one impossibly old. One whispering become, the other answering endure. And in both we see ourselves, because everything we are began the same way. We are dust that learn to wonder. If you want more, make sure to subscribe. The universe never stops making music, and we are lucky enough to listen.